Today, let me introduce our newest version software 4.0 for you. Firstly, let me, inter let me tell you the advantages of the software in briefly. First, it supports double screens up to 150 inch. Second, it supports Microsoft Windows driver. Third, it supports plenty of gesture recognitions. Before I show you all the functions, let me show the device first. The device includes two main parts, emitter and uh, sensor, and some accessories. One piece pointer and uh, one piece USB cable, one piece power adapter and mounts. One unit for single screen, two units for double screens. How to install and connect the device. For the sensor, it is fixed uh, to the projector by mounts and uh, connect to computer by USB cable. Another one emitter, it is fixed uh, on the middle of the projecting screen and distance to, to the upper edge of the projecting screen 2 to 3 centimeters and connect to power adapter. That is the installation and connection of the hardware. Now for the software, each one has CDs and there are calibration software and uh, application software in it. Firstly, we install the software in your computer and then you will find the icons in desk. IWB and GLBOD. IWB is the calibration software, GLBOD is the application software. Secondly, we calibrate the software. Open IWB and twice operation, choose automatic calibration. Our software cal supports automatic calibration for single screen. The calibration only takes 5 seconds to finish. For double screens, the calibration only takes 10 seconds to finish. You can see it is faster. After calibrate, let us test its accuracy. You can see when my finger moves and the mouse follows at once, so it is accurate. Now do mouse functions. Single click, double click, move, choose and right click. Hold on two seconds for right click. Now demo you the gesture recognitions. Two fingers zoom in, zoom out and rotate the picture. Five fingers slide up to maximize the windows. Five fingers slide up again to back to the windows. Five fingers slide down to minimize the windows. Five fingers slide left or right to shift the windows. Shift one window to another one. Open any one website. Two fingers zoom in, zoom out to the website. Single finger as a scroll bar, up and down the website. Palm thing one second to move the windows.
Tom slid up from the bottom side for opening all the windows in desk. You can you can choose which one you want to open and which one you'd like to close. Ten fingers slide down to minimize all the windows. Open paint. Our software supports Microsoft Windows driver, so it can support ten persons drive together. Now we can write uh, injunction between the two screens. You can see the writing is smooth and continuous. Okay, that's all the gesture recognitions in Windows. Next, uh, let me introduce another two advantages of the calibration software. First, uh, first one, prevent the interference from the light or obstacle in both surface, such as there is a, a obstacle in both. I cannot, uh, you can see I cannot do operation instead of the mouse. A few seconds later, I can do again. You can see when my finger move and the mouse follows at once. Well, the interference disappears. You can see the software back to the normal automatically. That is the characteristic of prevention of the interference. The stability of the device is highly improved and keeps the device work well all the time. The second one supports four projecting screens. You can see the bottom side is very closer to the frame, and I can do operation in the bottom side. Another similar product in the market, the projecting screen should keep more than five centimeters above the frame. And then for education software, GLBot, open GLBot, single finger to write, an eraser with palm. We apply the split pointer technical for double screens here, so I can write An eraser in junction between the two screens. You can see the writing is smooth and continuous. In GL border, it supports plenty of gesture recognitions too. Single finger to write. Eraser with palm. Two fingers away is palm the page as large as you can. And you also can insert pictures from the local source or the internet source. Single finger to move the picture. Two fingers zoom in, zoom out, and rotate the picture. I rotate the picture. Double click with single finger, move, move, uh, make notice. And you also can change it to different color. And a visa. Single click to move the picture again. You also can search for pictures from the internet source. And search.
And you can find many pictures here and drag out anyone. Move, zoom in, zoom out. Multi-touch, that's a special function. It can support the pin process right and eraser sim simultaneously. Change it to a different color. Write and eraser simultaneously. Smart pen. We can draw shapes. And move. Change the size and fill in different colors. And we also can measure the angle. Move. And the You can see it is a 41 degree. Make notes. 41 degree. And delete it. Something one second for spotlight. The teachers can focus on something to the students. We also we also can change the size. And uh, change the brightness. And move. If you want to hide the writing, you can open the mask. Uncover the writing and hide the writing. Double click with the palm back to the desktop. And uh, we can make notice on web on desktop. And either we also can we also can make notice on website. and make notice. Evisa. Change to different colors. And we also can save it. You can save it uh, in different types. You can choose any one as you need. And you can scan a PPT file in GL board. Open a PPT file. Press the PowerPoint. Open GL board. Press start and choose slide page navigation and, and then 
we can scan PPT file in GL bot. Page down. Page down. And make notice. Change it to a different color. And either. Close the PPT. And we also can and we also can play a video in GLBot. Choose any one video to open. And move the video. Zoom in, zoom out the video. And make notice. Uh, Evisa. While the video is playing in one screen, we can do an we can do operation in another one screen. Such as there the video is uh, playing in right uh, screen. Now we can do operation in the right screen. You can write an eraser and draw shapes. And we also can Record the screen. The teachers can record the class to the uh, and uh, share uh, and uh, share the uh, share the video to the students. It is convenient for students to learn and review the class at home. Now we make a video as an example. We can choose the stroke and move. And fill in different colors. Okay, well done. Now let us check out the video. You can see the video I am just recorded. Okay, that's all the functions of the new software. More products or more new functions, please pay more attention to our our website. Thank you.